But first, a surge in gun violence once again today in New York City. Good evening, everyone. I'm Joe Torres. And I'm Sandra Bookman. Just today, there have been at least eight shootings in four boroughs. There have been nearly two dozen shootings since this time last night. Three people have died. Eyewitness News reporter Stefan Kim has the story. The victim here in Canarsie was shot in the face by a gunman driving a U-Haul truck. Witnesses say that victim was standing here on the street when he was shot, part of a violent 24 hours in the city. Investigators on East 80th Street in Canarsie combing for clues after a 28-year-old man was shot in the face around 4.30 in an apparent drive-by shooting. Meanwhile, around 3 a.m. in Jamaica, Queens, another 28-year-old, this one an off-duty correction officer, killed when he was shot in the head and chest. I heard a few gunshots go off. Police sources say the murder of Officer John Jeff was a planned hit after he left a party with a fellow female correction officer and returned to that party. Three cars boxed him in. The suspect got out of the first car and shot Jeff while he and the woman were in the car. Sources say the suspect then grabbed Jeff's department-issued firearm and used it to shoot him several times and took off with that gun. Jeff has only been a correction officer for two years at Rikers Island. Angeline Simeon knew him. He was calm collected, you know, he minded his business. At Grand Central Terminal, a 40-year-old man tapped on his shoulder, then shot while waiting on the platform for a southbound 4 train around 10 a.m. His assailant shot him in the arm, then fled. The victim in stable condition as investigators try to figure out if the attack was random or targeted. In the past 24 hours, 20 shootings throughout the city, with 23 victims, three of them dead. Citizen app video showing the scene in the Soundview section of the Bronx, where a man was shot around 8 p.m. Not long after, a man shot in the Allerton section of the Bronx, and then a man shot in Washington Heights on West 188th Street. In Far Rockaway this afternoon, a 23-year-old man shot in the foot, that victim not cooperating with police. In the Belmont section of the Bronx just before 5 p.m., a 20-year-old man shot in the shoulder and hip who told police he was sitting outside when two men approached him and opened fire. That victim in stable condition. A little earlier in Flatbush, Brooklyn, a 26-year-old man shot in stable condition. That gunman fled the scene. Around the same time in East Harlem on 102nd Street, a 29-year-old man shot once in the back in stable condition. Just after 11 p.m. last night at a block party on Malcolm X Boulevard in 112th Street, four shot, three women and a man, all should survive, no arrests. In Harlem on West 128th Street, just before 1 a.m., a 30-year-old shot and killed, and three men shot on Dean Street in Brooklyn, including a 21-year-old shot twice in the back and a 22-year-old grazed in his head. Back here in Cronarsie, police say the victim is in critical condition. No word yet on a motive or how many suspects police are looking for.